Bruce is cooking dinner. The table shows cooking times for his dinner. So he cooked chicken, which took him one hour, 40 minutes. He cooked potatoes, which took him 20 minutes. And then he cooked peas, which took him 10 minutes. Bruce starts cooking the chicken at 5, 10 p.m. So this is our clue. He wants everything to finish cooking at the same time. This is our second clue. At what time should Bruce start cooking the peas? So they are being very specific about the time Bruce finished cooking. And in this case, they only want to know at what time did Bruce start cooking the peas? Now, the thing that we have to remember is Bruce is cooking all of these items separately. So, the first clue that has been given is that Bruce started cooking the chicken at 5, 10 p.m. So if you were to start cooking the chicken, it has taken him one hour and 40 minutes. So by the time he finished cooking the chicken, this, the time, the, the finishing time was 6.50 p.m. Now this is important for us because chicken is the only item which is taking the longest to finish. Now peas and potatoes and chicken, they all need to finish at the same time. So in this case we can safely say that they all should finish, all should finish at 6.50 p.m. So if we have 6.50 p.m. as the final finishing time, we can simply take the piece and subtract the time it takes to cook the peas from the finishing time to give us the starting the starting time for the peas which should give us 6:40 p.m. as the start cooking time for peas so the answer is C.